guys, this is Nidhi. Welcome back to my channel, Nidhi's World. So guys, if you're watching the video now without watching my previous video, please do watch it. The Gauri Puja preparation video. So that you can understand what is happening in this video. And see my new frock. This is made by my Nana Masari. Isn't it nice? Okay. So there are a bit more preparations which we made. Let me talk you through it. So here in front of our house, they have cleaned the area, this much area and spread it, spread cow dung and a beautiful rangoli made by my Tulsi auntie. So isn't it really good? This is the first preparation. And now let's move on to the other one. So this is the second preparation made by Duple Tata, the Torna, which we call in Kannada, Mavinele Torna. It is made by mango leaves and this is a garland made by my grandma. So look at those flowers, nice and yellow, bright and so big. Now this is the second preparation and the third one is... My grandma has arranged this beautifully. We have all the god and lots of flowers and god pictures everywhere. And this is the offering to the god. This is the smaller one which I did not show yesterday. So this time we have done it in a simple way. This is the opatu, the puliogre. This is the potato, palya, the kosumri which I told yesterday, moong dal and cucumber and some coconut. This is the obatan saru. You can also call it rasam and rice. Curd rice. This is the offering. So this is it in our house. There is still in the chow tree, the hall. As I told yesterday, we were doing it in Swami's house, but we took permission and they said okay to do it in the hall. So we are doing it in the hall itself. And they bring gangi from the river and the sand gauri they keep five types of gauri but i don't know how are they gonna bring the gange and everything this time i'm curious now let me go and get ready and i'll be back in no time so guys i got ready and every time the gange puja we do it in the river but this time we are doing it in our house now the arrangements are going on and my aunt is painting the gauri, the silver gauri and I'll show you all the gauris after the puja. So this is our board. We took the water from here and we are arranging all the gauri. So in some time the puja will start. Shishi Mama is preparing all these things and you can see some five rocks over there. They call it Benakappa in Kannada. So guys, here are the five gauris. This is the turmeric gauri. This is the clay gauri. This is the kalasa gauri. And here we have the silver gauri. And here in the back. So guys, here are the five gauris. And this is the sand gauri. These are the Ben Kappas. This is one, two, three, four, five, five rocks. Here we have five pambulas for all the five girls.
So guys, here you can see I'm doing a puja. This is the Swarna Gauri puja. We do it for all the five Gauris, which I showed earlier. Now here it is called as Harti in Kannada. We are doing it to the God. This is the Marada Bhagna which we made. In Kannada, this is called as Bhagna Belgodu. This is the ones which we prepared in the previous video which was yesterday. I helped my aunt doing it. My aunt and my grandma is doing the bag Marada Bhagnas. Now the Tarte Bhagnas, my mom and my grandma are doing them. All the six Bhagnas. Three for my mom and three for my grandma as I told before. So that is how you do it with your sari. Now here we are giving the bhagna. This is Shashi Mama's mother. We give it the first bhagna to them. You can see that is how they give and they tie a flower with a thread like that onto your hand. That is a religious practice. So you can see that is how you do it and all the procedure we've been continuing it from a very long time. Now they're giving the bhagna. They give it like this. <laughs> So guys, our Gauri Puja is completed. So this is it for today's video. If you do like my video, please do like, share and subscribe. And I'll see you tomorrow in the Ganesha Puja. Goodbye.